What's poppin' people? It's your boy JRAS and <laughs> Wait a sec, do you smell that? Oh, I can smell the stench of idiot TikTokers. Yeah, there's a new challenge about, and it's uh probably the worst one yet in my opinion. Some friends of mine told me about it, concerning the fact that I barely use TikTok. It's a steaming pile of trash, almost as bad as Twitter. And it's called the Dancing on Graves Challenge. Man, already I can tell you this is going to be one of the best things I've ever seen in my life. I am so excited. Before I get started, if you haven't done so already, please like and subscribe if you enjoy the content I made today. As you can see, most of you beautiful people don't even subscribe to me, but you still watch me. I mean, come on, if you're watching my stuff, you must like me, right? So please, if you have it within your heart to do so, give me a fat old sub and a like as well. Helps my content get out to more people. And honestly, that's what I want. Thank you for your time. Now, on to the degeneracy. As a bit of a foreword, the title of the hashtag, the title of the trend, the challenge, whatever you want to call this dipshit type thing, it's pretty self-explanatory. These are pretty much TikToks of people dancing across graves and dancing on graves. So yeah, as I said, wonderful stuff, wonderful stuff. Let's regrettably watch one, shall we? First things first, dyed hair. <laughs> Somebody wants attention, and I guess she got it, so I hope she's happy. I guarantee you she won't be happy, though. Especially when Bowman comes out of his grave to haunt her ass for her entire lifetime. Also, what is that abomination of a dance? Quote-unquote dance. I think the quotes are an important addition, because I would not consider that a dance. What she's doing looks more like a vertical version of a fish flailing on land, begging for oxygen, and dying. Also, why the hell are there kids in this? You think it'd be funnier if there were kids in it like, Look at these funny kids, guys. Look, look, my kid's wearing a ghost costume. Isn't that funny? <laughs> we're making fun of dead people. Look, a ghost. Woohoo, scary. The only scary thing about this is the fact that you think this would be enjoyable content, you dumb woman. The only thing that would make this TikTok more interesting is if she fell off and cracked her bony ass head on the ground. Because frankly, she deserves it for defiling graves. <laughs> Now listen, I'm not one to fat shame or anything. For the most part, if you're positive about your body, that's fine by me. But if you do this kind of fucked up shit, I'm gonna call you by your true name, you fat fucking whale. I mean, sheesh, god damn, I did not know a species of land whale existed. I honestly can't tell if she's fat or not, but from the looks of it, she is, so no mercy. I'm also not too sure why she's having a seizure and moving around at the same time. Uh, yeah, hold on. I have sources coming and telling me that she's actually supposed to be dancing. Shit, you could have fooled me. And then we've got this Neanderthal coming in doing a little Fortnite boogie down, a little Fortnite wiggle emote. Hey man, listen, the boogie down challenge ended a while ago. You're a little late to the party. Oh my fucking god, he went back and did it a second time. He didn't just stop there, he went back and took a little shit on the grave a second time. I honestly can't tell who's more dead inside, the person in the grave or you. Because you fuckers clearly don't have souls. Absolutely zero respect. <laughs> Oh, saw, dude, whoa. We've got Stoner Barry over here, Stoner Steven. He smokes so much fucking weed, he just started dancing on some graves, man. Holy shit. Okay, I was talking about the Fortnite thing before, but that's literally one of the emotes from Fortnite. Or at least that dance move in particular is only popular in Fortnite these days. That shit died back in 2018. I like this part the most, though. He's trying to be a little quirky with the little finger touching thing, you know. Tee hee, oo woo, whatever the fuck that is supposed to be. I think it's cringe as fuck. But I really liked it when he fell backwards on his head, because he fucking deserves that shit. Not exactly sure how he got the hose in there, but hey, stoners have their ways. Last but not least, I think it's important to note that cemeteries and graveyards are not graveyards, okay? They are not concerts, so put your shirt back on, alright? You're not gonna get Michael Jackson to come out of his grave and put on a little performance for you. Even if he could, he wouldn't do it for you, because you're a dickhead, so, yeah. Those were the only three that I could find, and honestly, I don't feel like looking for more. I think three is a pretty good number. The rule of three and everything. So, those were three miserably horrible TikToks that was awful to look at, because of the complete disrespect and disregard for the loss of human life. When you enter a graveyard or a cemetery, there is a level of dignity and respect you need to uphold, 
clearly these people do not understand that. They should be banned from every resting place on earth because that is where people are laid to rest. That's their final resting place. And whether you believe in an afterlife or not, you still have to maintain a certain level of reverence. Don't go pissing and shitting on their bones, you idiot. Don't go break dancing on someone's resting place, you morons. And I'm not talking to you guys in particular. At least I hope none of you do that, but you get the idea. I'm just putting this out there. Aside from that little rant, that about wraps it up. This challenge is terrible. You know, I thought Tide Pods were bad, but TikTok always manages to one-up itself in terms of shit ideas. That's about it for today. If you haven't already, do like and subscribe. Follow all my socials, especially my Twitch. I love streaming on that. And all will be well in the world if you do the things I asked. And if you don't, then people will dance on your graves when you die. RIP. Seriously though, thank you guys for watching. This has been your boy JRS. Wondering why TikTokers like to torment the dead. Signing off. Peace. Thank you.